bitches in a mansion. The bridge so many rock them diamonds on me dancing. When you working hard, then your money start expanding. I got model bitches wanna make me like some candy. And them drugs come in handy. Last night, savage bitch, but no, I'm not Randy. Hit her with no condom, had to make her eat a plant. And I'm sipping on that cold D, not brandy. I'm just stunting on my ex, bitch. Huh? I'm just flexing on my ex, bitch. Hold up. I'm just stunting on my ex, bitch. Huh? I'm just flexing on my ex, bitch. Fuck a wedding ring, I bought a necklace. Diamonds got the flu, try not to catch this. I left that hoe alone cause she was ratchet. All these bitches salty, they can't stand If you're new, don't forget to like and subscribe in order to hang out with the gang, if you know what I'm saying. And today is, it's going to be like a short film for today, but I'm going to try and film all week. Right now, I'm making oatmeal. Yes. I like to put sausage in my oatmeal because I don't really like the texture. Like oatmeal and grits, it's something about the texture. I got to have like some meat or something else with it, like with grits. I could eat eggs with grits, but I prefer like some meat or something. Like I'm gonna do with this sausage. I put it into pieces and I'm gonna mix it in. I actually got this from my mom when she was uh feeding my nephew and he will always eat sausage in his oatmeal. So that's where I got it from. And ever since then, I've been eating oatmeal and sausage. Can I see it? That's what it looked like. Ooh, I need to fall it out. But yeah. But guess what? While well, I let this cool off, hold on. Y'all, I done finally got me a camera. Well, right now I'm filming on my phone. I gotta get an SD card for my camera. It's a it's like for beginners because y'all know I'm new with this, but it's a Sony. It's by Sony and it's a digital camera, Z V F1. That's what it looks like. It comes with like this. I think this like uh, blocks the wind. Something like that. I don't know. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It's very small. But I'm going to start filming on this. The battery ran down. Well, I didn't even charge it when I first got out the box, but the battery is a little low. But when I get the SD card, I'm going to get it today. I'm going to charge this. And I'm debating if I want to, like, finish the video or, like, finish my vlog on my phone. Or if I want to go ahead and, like, start using this. I might um experiment with this first. I'm going to still film on my phone, but I'm going to experiment with this for a couple days. And my parents are supposed to be coming Friday. So hopefully I'll be filming on my camera by Friday. That's the plan. We're going to see though. So I got to stop by Ulta because I ran out of product for my face, y'all. I ran out of uh, hyaluronic acid. I ran out of vitamin C serum and some other stuff. So... I did an uh, online pickup at Ulta, so I'm going to stop by there. And then I got to go by Walmart and get an SD card. Y'all, I'm so excited. This is like new beginnings for me. I can't wait to really use that camera. That's like really what I'm mostly excited about. But... I'm going to go run these errands, and then I got to go to work later, so this uh, video for today is going to be short. And y'all, can y'all see my hair? Oh my god. It's a hot mess. Like, I don't even know what to do with it anymore, so I'm taking it down this week. Like, I got to. Like, look, look at my edges. Look at that. Just a hot mess. I don't even know what to do with my hair anymore. I just threw it in a bun. 
back here just to get something like i don't know but i'm taking it down this week so y'all gonna watch me do that y'all ain't gonna watch the whole thing i'm just i don't know we're gonna see i don't even know what to do with my natural hair whenever I do take it down. Like, am I gonna put it in a puff? Am I gonna blow dry? Am I gonna slap a wig on? It's really too hot for a wig, to be honest. We gonna see. I might just throw it in a puff, do a twist out, wear it for like a day, and then take it down the next day. Probably wear it in a fro for one day, and then it's gonna be in a puff for like, I don't know, to the next wash day. So. I'm gonna eat this oatmeal and y'all will see me at Ulta. Y'all tell me why I just pulled up at AutoZone. I had to call my daddy because my car started was starting a little slow. I don't know if my uh the ends on my battery are corroded or if it's just something in general with the battery. So we fixing to go on the AutoZone right quick and see if they can come help us. Shout out to all the dads because without my daddy, I wouldn't even know what to do. To get my battery checked. We can do this real easy. Okay. Going outside. Okay. Been having to jump it. Uh, not necessarily. Uh, I checked the battery voltage. It's on 14.3, but I don't know if it's the ends on the battery that might be corroded. Gotcha. Yeah, that sounds like your alternator is charging. Let's see what's going on. That's not corrosion. Somebody has overdone it with some grease they put on there to stop corrosion. Okay. Yeah, that's what that is. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. They, uh, there is such thing as too much of a good thing. Yeah. But it's not going to hurt anything. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. You said it was 14 something when it was running yeah it was like 14.4 yeah. 14.3 14 yeah, that, that is that is perfect as far as your alternator charging okay yeah let's, let's see what we got here and it's in his 12.4 which is real close to a fully charged battery it will pass the test as far as voltage my machine's asking for some juice now we'll see what happens wow that battery have a good connection. Go ahead and start it. Let's look at your alternator and then we're going to read this. Okay. It was a little slow to crank. Yeah. you buy this battery or to come with the car uh i'm not sure my dad is the one that does everything gotcha everything with the alternator looks good okay. let's turn it off again let's try and test the battery okay just turn it off yes ma'am
selling this bad battery again. Yeah. I don't know if it's got a warranty with it or anything like that. You can check with your dad. Okay. Um, the two I'm going to have are going to be... Y'all, tell me why I went to Walmart. I got this little stand for my camera and I had got my SD card. When I got back in the car, little Terry acted like she didn't want to start. I was like, all right, little Terry, you got to make it till Friday. And she's going to make it till Friday because she ain't got no choice. But, yeah, that was a little embarrassing. But ain't nobody seen nothing. I ain't seen nothing, so ain't nobody else seen nothing either. So, I went and picked up my Ulta order. I ended up getting my eye patches. And then I got some more hyaluronic acid and some retinol. And then I got some rose water and I got some more sunscreen for my face. I also got uh, some more stuff coming in through the mail from Amazon. Well, one of them already came in. I was supposed to get these. It's a uh, SD card adapter so I can plug it into my iPad and a uh, camera case, a small carrying case for my camera and other stuff that goes with it. Somebody, it was uh, delivered over the weekend while I was at work, and somebody stole my package. I had uh, went over to my neighbors and asked them if they seen it, and they was like, they didn't see it. So I ended up calling customer service, and they are sending me my small carrying case. This one, it just came, this one just came in. This is the uh, SD card reader. But, yeah, this came in today, and my camera case is coming in Wednesday or Thursday so yeah y'all it's just a lot going on right now so
today is Thursday. I think today's Thursday. Don't get me wrong. I ended up taking my hair down off camera. Y'all, I really been struggling. I really been struggling to wake up at the time that I need to wake up. And I mean, like, it's not a big thing, but it's a it's a big deal to me. Ooh, okay, okay, my edge is growing back. Okay, but you see, y'all, shrinkage is real. Like, but I need to get a comb. I'm not fixing to make these parts straight because I'm gonna end up taking this down like the next day and I'm gonna split my hair in four sections and I'm gonna probably do like four to five big little dookie twists, whatever you wanna call it, and call it a day. Like I got some stuff to do. I picked up a shift today, it's only like four hours. So I'm gonna be doing that. And what else am I doing today? Oh, I'm doing somebody here today. I'm not a licensed beautician, y'all. But doing hair is something that I like to do. My mom's a hairstylist and I watched her do that all my life. So I just do that on the side. I finally got an SD card for my camera and I charged it. Let, well, not last night, but the night before last. So I'll probably end up recording on that. What's today, Thursday? I'll record on that tomorrow. Yes. I'm low key really excited. So excited. My hair is so freaking thick, bro. I just want to chop it off. Having natural hair, period, is just a lot of maintenance. And I be sitting like with my clients, they be having dementia and Parkinson's. And whenever I come over with my natural hair, because sometimes I be switching up my hairstyles if I sit with them on a the regular, they be wanting to touch my hair. And they be like, do you wash your hair every day? Like they be asking questions like that. And they be like, oh my gosh, you have so much hair. Like uh, I was sitting with my one client yesterday and I had just took my hair down before uh, I had went to that shift. And I had told them that uh, it took me, like it literally took me two and a half hours to take my hair down by myself but if i had another person with me it would have knocked it down by an hour so it would have took an hour and 30 minutes if i had another person helping me see if i had enough time today see i ain't even gonna say if i had enough time today if i would have woke up earlier like I was supposed to and the thing is I be waking up early I just go back to sleep bro and I hate that like somebody need to like come push me out of bed like get your girls up but I ain't got nobody to do that I gotta do that for myself and then my dog don't make it no better because she sleep with me and she be all up on me and that body heat Oh my gosh, like, how can you not just stay in bed? And then like, my biggest hater, bro, my biggest hater is them blackout curtains. It's pitch dark up in my room. <laughs> like, I'm just down bad, y'all. Just down bad. 
Luckily, oh, look at that. Look at the definition. Yes. African shea butter. This is crack. What do you mean by that? This is the crackhead. Crack. Crackhead. <laughs> but luckily, I signed up for volunteer hours and I made them early in the morning so I could get up like I need to. Because I've been slacking in the gym too. And I really need to get back in there. Because that's how I get my thoughts processed on everything that I need to do. Y'all, the curls are curling. And all I did was put this blue magic and the African shea butter. See, I want to wear it like this, but knowing when my hair dry, I'm going to be looking like Lord Danbury. Off Queen Charlotte. And I can't do that. <laughs> so, what we're going to do, we're going to take these sections, y'all. And we're going to twist these bad boys up. It might be more than four twists, <laughs> but they're not just gonna be perfect. You know, it's gonna be sloppy, but it's gonna get the job done. I ordered some uh some more shampoo and conditioner, and I think I got some leave-in conditioner. Mia had a sale, and your girl had to hop on it, so I got more than I need to. Guilty. And I know it's going to last me a long time. A very long time. I don't even wash my hair that much. So it wasn't even no point in me getting all that. See, that's my problem. I be overspending. Because I bought like shampoo, conditioner, and leave-in conditioner from like four different collections. Mm. No, I don't need that much. I should have just got out one set and called it a day. But no, your girl had to test drive multiple, multiple collections. And this is my first time using Mia. And you know, everybody was talking about like when it was having a little trend with the rosemary oil and that lady ended up changing the products to fit the white folks. I wanted to try the oil, but I take my hair pretty seriously and if I'm having speculations about a product I'm just not gonna use it so I just didn't end up using it or ended up buying it when I finish with this I got a dryer in my uh second bedroom and i'm just gonna let her dry for a few minutes i got a milkshake that i got from second shake last night and i was full so i ended up sticking it in the freezer but now i'm letting it unthought and your girl gets num 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 on that while i send it to dry <laughs> oh but i'm gonna do that i got my therapy appointment at one o'clock and I've been missing my girl because I really want to talk to her about some stuff that's been on my mind. <sighs> It'd be so hard to hold my thoughts in. And I need to get another journal because I only got like six pages. I think like six pages left on that journal. <sighs> and my thoughts is too big for six pages. So I just been holding it in. I'm gonna be looking like Seely off the color purple. You 
know. You and me has never part my gift to her. <laughs> yeah, this is way more than what I said. It's gonna be four or five of you section. Girl, bye. You knew it was gonna be more. Just be lying to these folks. I promise I don't be lying to y'all. I was just making an estimate. I was picturing it in my mind. And the picture just think I was playing. <sighs> when I finish this. And if I have enough time left before I go to my therapy appointment, I'm going to show y'all all I got from here. Because I didn't even open the box yet. I was I was planning on opening it on camera for y'all. So that's what we're going to do. I low-key like this better than the other kind. The other kind was yellow, but this is white. I'm going to start getting this. I like this more than the yellow kind because it stains everything. The yellow one, and I don't like that. Because every time I lay in my bonnets, it would uh go through my bonnet and stain my pillows. I always call it the iodine. And my friends would call it iodine too. section is almost complete you know bro doing this without any breaks and people wonder how your arms are so toned baby this doing your own hair in one position one position only you gonna have some strong arms not strong some strong arms That's what I'm talking about. I really didn't have that much shedding. Uh, actually, when I took my hair down, I just went ahead and like combed out the naps, and it wasn't bad. That actually helps prevent my hair from shedding more when I actually wash it. But it wasn't that much shedding in the sink. This is what it looks like. I'll come back when it's when I got these two sections in line. But probably when I finish the whole thing. I'm gonna do both.
y'all this is how much hair that i lost after it being detangled and whenever i did the little twist out it wasn't even a lot compared to like if i detangled my hair and washed it without doing all the extra stuff when i actually took my hair out those braids but it would have been a lot more but it's actually cut down on all the shit Oh, here goes the package I was telling y'all about. Now I'm just gonna open it. Mm -hmm. Did I tell y'all good morning? Good morning and welcome to another day. Y'all yeah, struggling to get out of here. Again, like when I tell y'all it's getting really hard, I think I'm gonna have to like open up them blackout curtains because i feel like that's what's making me struggle to get out of bed really because this it, it don't make no sense i done set my alarm three different times and i would turn it off and go right back to sleep like i'm down bad y'all because now it is 10 11. i should have been up at six well i was up but i kept going back to sleep all that i don't even need all this let me see, let me see, let me see. here is the mango and tosi nourishing conditioner i like the colors let's see what's this one i'm gonna try and match them if i can find them okay this is the shampoo and this is the leave-in conditioner. That's one collection. Then here is the Honey and Oats Blend Soothing Conditioner. And then this is the Honey and Oats Soothing Conditioner and Shampoo. Let's see. Then this is the avocado and to, I don't know if I'm saying this right. Tamanu anti-frizz conditioner and shampoo. And I got the leave-in conditioner. You know I gotta get the leave-in conditioner. And then this is collection number four of something that I don't need. This is the sea moss anti shedding conditioner and shampoo infused with saw palmetto. What is saw palmetto? I really like the packaging. The um, uh, it's really cute. Like it's like metallic. It's giving metallic if it's not. This is the leave-in condition. I don't know which one I want to try first. Oh, for kind of got this. This is for my face. This is the Miel Pomegranate and Honey Blend Vitamin C Under Eye Drops. I forgot I had ordered this. We're gonna try it out. Yeah. Y'all, I gotta stop overspending. Cause how am I gonna use all of this? Oh well, I'm stacked. So I ain't gotta worry about buying them for a long time. But yeah, they had a sale. Like all their products were seven dollars. So you know your girl had to hop on that. I had to take a picture of this. So I can do it as a thumbnail. Uh, what is it, Mama? She probably home too. No. I'm gonna be her, and I'm gonna take me out something to eat real quick. Cause I'm just gonna go back in bed and lay down for a little bit. I'm gonna talk to y'all later today. <laughs> Everywhere. 
Much else going on. I, I got a house full of kids, so I'll just talk to y'all next week. Bye. You want to say bye? You want to say bye? Say bye. All right.